after investigators say they found their children living in a home with their dead grandfather inside. Now, the home has been deemed unsafe, but the couple says the kids were never in danger. The charges was abuse. We did not abuse our kids. Melissa Poole and Jeremy Dishner say they're hoping they can set the record straight after their arrest Friday on child abuse charges. Invest say they found five children living in their home in Statesville with Poole's dead father inside. The home has also been deemed unsafe to live in. Tonight, Poole says the five kids were never in danger. Even a social worker said we did not abuse our kids. That's why they didn't take our kids. Deputies told Eyewitness News earlier today they found uneaten food on the bed of the 62-year-old deceased man. Deputies believe the children were the ones who left the food there. They also told us they believe the body had been there for more than 24 hours. Poole told us her children often took food into her father's room, but she would never have them do that if she knew her father had passed. She claims they called police as soon as they found him. As for reports, investigators found raw sewage under the home, spoiled food inside, and debris piled up on the floor. My kids have been sick with the flu, rotavirus. It's, it's been happening for a month. There was things that wasn't taken care of. I feel like I'm getting accused of being a bad mom for worrying about my kids rather than my house. Deputies say they have contacted DSS about the allegations along with the health department. If there was reason for me not to have my kids, I would have my kids right now. If there was reason for um, the social service to be concerned, I would have had a report on me before this. Now, those children remain with Poole and Dishner. Poole told us that she does have custody as long as she doesn't take them back to that trailer. The couple is scheduled to go before a judge next month.